Kicking off our Million Mile Challenge is our first Make-A-Wish kid, Kristen Interachadoc. She recently graduated from high school, was very active in JROTC, loves animals, and wants to be a veterinarian when she grows up. Here's Kristen's story. Welcome to my room. <laughs> 19-year-old Kristen Interachadoc's smile is infectious, as is her laugh. <laughs> so, of course, this is Patricia. I have had her since around about third grade. She also loves her stuffies, in particular, her Build-A-Bear. I believe I got Barry second. There's the one her brother gave her, which she named Kristen Jr., and this one, Bunny Wish Star. Emphasis on the wish because Kristen is a Make-A-Wish kid. Her story starts in 2022. She and her mom, Lada, got COVID. At the time, mom was getting better. Kristen was not. But then afterwards, after the emergency room visit, they said, well, you know, um, Kristen's uh, white blood cells, you know, they uh, look um, funny. They're uh, pretty high, so we're going to send it to an out-of-state lab. That was on Tuesday. And by Friday, the pediatrician called to say, um, I'm sorry, but your daughter um, has leukemia. Within a matter of hours, Kristen was airlifted to Seattle Children's Hospital. What they thought would be a couple days stay turned into seven months and five rounds of chemotherapy. I still had my hair during the first round and then a little bit more during the second round. It basically all completely fell out. Yeah, it was really hard because she had pretty long hair. And uh, yeah, as a girl, you know, as a woman, it's, you know, uh, it feels like it makes you who you are. She was also isolated during a lot of her stay because of the pandemic. But what did bring her comfort was a package the hospital gave her on her first night and a Build-A-Bear from her family. I remembered how much that package had impacted me, and I, I wanted to do that for the other kiddos there, especially because I, I, I wanted to make them happy. And she did. For Kristen's wish, she could have chosen just about anything but her wish... Yeah, I wanted to give back. Make-A-Wish granted Kristen's dream of bringing in a Build-A-Bear workshop to the hospital, complete with the stuffing machine, clothing options, and hundreds of bears that found new homes. But what was even more impactful to me are the parents where you get to go back and see your children be children. An experience to this day Kristen and her family won't forget and are grateful to Make-A-Wish for making not only her dream come true, but other kids as well.